to have Jim Beglin beside me. Thanks for that, Peter. Hi, everyone. The excitement has really picked up now, and I'm eager for the action to start. The instantly recognisable sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem, the perfect backdrop to this eagerly awaited night of European football. forward quickly Bruno Fernandes Rafa with a delicate ball he'll have a tip pumps it upfield defense has got rid of that Nkunku looks to dink one in he's made sure that that won't get through has got good distance on that aimed long and direct yeah, he's fouled in there has shown him a yellow card players protesting furiously but there's little or no sympathy from the ref well it was deliberate it was cynical and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity but it had to be done he's trying the shot they've got away with it this time but I think if they carry on giving away free kicks in positions like that I think they'll be made to pay they've got to be very careful just a little more discipline is called for away from immediate danger who's going to make this theirs that's good progress he's made on the ball where to next Ball swung in. Ambitious to say the least. He seemed to be in a hurry to get that in. That's beautifully weighted. Martial. Lobs it in gently. Clears it out of harm's way. 
Nkunku spoon forward Moran does well to read it and intercepts out to the left it goes looks to bypass the midfield and the first half is done no goals at this stage but certainly not devoid of action it is nil nil here at half time and the action is back on the way Manchester United can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Well, when the keeper lost control of that, usually a striker would, would react first, so that defender deserves praise. That's a throw. Swung in towards the middle. Yeah, he's offering an apology for that. He needed to deliver a better ball. Halla. Looks to slip it through. Brown looking to get on the end of this. Cut out in the nick of time. Olmo passes it through. Peters. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frighten the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Tries to get it forward quickly. Aimed long and direct. Leipzig are not functioning with the cutting edge they need. We're seeing too much passing and not enough reward. It's time for more drive and certainly for more penetration. Pumps it upfield. Halda looks to get on the end of this. Olmo. Now the cross. Hits it first time! Saved only by poor finishing. Yeah, not only do they hit fast on the counter-attack, Peter, but they show terrific effort and desire in, in getting forward in good numbers. picked on here yeah and if they're going to try and stop him in this fashion Peter um, they're going to really test the referee's patience from here well what was required then was a little more patience he didn't have to cross it so early Nkunku goes wide Leipzig may think they're going about this in the right way, but not if a series of passes is leading to no end product. They have to add the incision. Campbell. Who's going to make this theirs? The final whistle. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps.